just outside Vivint Smart Home Arena, South Dakota State set to face Gonzaga here on Thursday afternoon. Now one of the key stats down the stretch for the Jackrabbits has been rebounding. In fact, the Jacks have only lost one game this season when they out-rebounded their opponent. It's a relatively simple stat, but it's something that head coach TJ Otzelberger preached down the stretch. I think overall it's just that emphasis. It's continually talking about it. It's not so much as doing drills and beating each other up as, as the awareness to it, technically being more sound, but having that competitive will. And I think for our guys, uh, there's a lot of teams out there that play well as a group. I'm not sure that anybody plays us together or for each other as our guys have this six weeks. Really proud of them for that. And I think there's such a uh, ownership and accountability to each other that they want to get stops and finish plays because they know how important it is for the success of their team. So I think our guys have just made that overall commitment to each other and uh, obviously as a coach, pretty, really proud of them for that. You know, at the start of the year, we were trying to kind of figure out what was wrong while we were losing. We didn't really look at rebounding aspect part of it. We were just going by turnovers and then we started just out rebounding guys and, and then our net record was just like staggering like 14 and one right now if we out rebound our opponents. And uh, next thing you know in practice, that's, that's what we were hammering on was rebounding. So uh, every game is just a fight. You know, no matter what momentum swing is going on, just try to rebound the best you can. I think it goes back to that game in Omaha um, when, when we were playing them at their place. I think we beat them by 15 or so uh, on, the, on the boards. And I, I think since then, I got, our guys have really put a focus on rebounding. And, you know, that's been one of the main focuses in order to win the game. Stay tuned for more coverage from Salt Lake City up until game time on Thursday afternoon. For Jack Rabbit Journal, I'm David Brown.